athleticism, Clark. He brings a lot of intangibles, though. And I remember talking early in his career with Tom Izzo up at Michigan State saying the, those exact things that he gives you so much more than just what you see. And his current coach and our former partner, Steve Kerr, raves about him. He's the heart and soul of the Warriors in Steve's words. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Thank you, Kevin. I got a chance to hear what the Cavaliers head coach was saying to his team. He let his players know that they've got to do a better job on defense. He said, they're scoring any way they want. We've got to show some pride here. Let's make a stand defensively, get a stops, and get on a run of our own. Do they have it in them, Kevin? You know, you, you talk about Green's enthusiasm for the game. He's constantly talking, whether defensively or even in, in an opponent's ear. He's a vocal presence. And also, another example of, of how a guy can make an impact without necessarily having it show up in the stat sheet. The Cavaliers trail by 14. LeBron passes to Irving. LeBron drives in. Shot to end this whole run. D cannot forget about him like that. He'll light you up big time. Yeah, saw some things that just weren't working for them and wants to make some adjustments. Yeah, and no reason to wait around to do that, Greg. I mean, might as well make those adjustments right away. Now a timeout called by Golden State. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. No block shot. Iguodala, no good. The Cavaliers have gone just one of six in the field to start the fourth quarter. A bit of a slowdown for them right now. And Thompson sends it back. He's giving them little to nothing at the offensive end. I can't put it any other way. Iguodala, that's good. And also, don't discount his leadership. Draymond Green's been a vocal leader his entire career, even as a rookie. He wasn't afraid to challenge his teammates, and that competitive spirit, guys, can be contagious. James kicks to Smith. I'm open. Come Irving against Curry. Rocket six. Irving dishes to James. A leaner. And that's an air ball. Not even close. Now Iguodala. Inside. Here's Green. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket's good. He'll go to the line. And this is going to end in a lopsided victory. I, I love the tenacity and aggressiveness, as well as the ability to close. You really got to give it up here for the Warriors. Clark, the biggest factor tonight had to be their great shooting. They shot much better than the other team. You know, I thought both teams worked hard at both ends, but sky-high field goal percentage and pressure defense to force the other team into a lot of misses. Excellent effort tonight. And words can hardly describe the way these guys have come out game after game after game and been dominant facing both conferences. When they hit the 72 win mark, we thought it couldn't continue. And when they rewrite the record books once more, we'll say, wow, we were glad we watched it all. What a team. I mean, when you look at the stats, you'll see just how dominant a game this was for Thompson. Just an outpouring of points from him. Nobody could do much to keep him from dropping it in. Some of the shots he's taken have been real head scratchers. I mean, come on. He's out there playing like it's a game of horse at the park. The fans are just loving what's going on here tonight. A really good win for the home team. It sure is. I mean, they kept this crowd in the game, gave them plenty to cheer about, and really used that home court advantage to their advantage. And another miss by Cleveland. It's stolen by Smith. LeBron outside. Another miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. All right, fellas, let's see if we can take it. Couple stops, a couple buckets, and W. Now a timeout called by Golden State. Guys, what's your take? You know, this is a timeout maybe just so they can pat each other on the back because no other reason to call it. Well, they're really just being conservative, making sure they don't make any last-minute mistakes, I guess. I mean, I have no idea. No idea. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. This game may not have been the most...